don't fall was I good of buying her where I would go. I was looking at mine so hard I was trying to gain all this world. same Bible I'd preached out of the Sunday before and I laid it on, on my desk and I said I'm through and uh, I began to pour my complaint before the Lord and I began to tell him what all was wrong and the Holy Ghost every time I'd say something and I'd lay it out it's like the Spirit of God speak to my heart and he'd say you're right but you're not going to hell. <laughs> and I'd talk on, I'd talk on a little further, and I'd, I'd pour more complaint before the Lord, and I'd point this person out and this situation out, and the Holy Ghost say, "You're right." Amen. But you're not going to hell. <laughs> about 30 minutes of me went losing that argument I reached over and I grabbed a pen and I wrote at the top of that piece of paper I'm not going to hell and I want to say something tonight and uh, I know sometimes a lot of folks don't think young people have have heartaches and burdens there's no doubt in my mind that there's young people under the, under, under the roof that you're fighting things that you, fight, you think it's brought you to the end. And, you, and, you, and, and you, your problem, your complaint is right. You are right. You've got a problem. 
But I want to say something. You may have that problem or this problem or this problem or this problem. And that's the truth. But I want to say this. If you know him, you are not going to hell. You say, preacher, you say, preacher, you don't know the pain I'm feeling and the thoughts it's gone through. I had somebody just a few days ago tell me, he said, preacher, he said, I'm in the darkest place of my life that I've ever been. And he sat down and told me, and I said, you're right. You are. But I said, one thing I can say, you're not going to hell. And can I say something here about young person? You listen to me. Don't let the devil lie to you. Amen. Can I tell you something? If you're saved by the grace of God tonight, you've got a God that's on your side. And the devil's a liar. Amen. The devil is a liar. Amen. I'm just going to go ahead and say it. If you're in a place where you think your only option is to take your life. You got a God that loves you. You're worth something. You're worth something to him. Don't you let him lie to you. Don't you let him lie to you. So there was a time in sin I was living. No thought was I given of dying or where I would go. I was looking so hard I was trying to gain all this world had to hold. See, as a lost man, no peace and no pleasure could I even measure in all I tried to gain. This was my solution. I repented and prayed. God saved me that day. And now I've got something to say. Since I've been forgiven, you see Christ made a real change in me. You see, I'm no longer crying when I think about dying because heaven is waiting for me. Oh, but Satan, he's still lying and he's always trying to lead you down. Amen. 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 